Routine continues to be important at this stage, but your child will have a much more developed sense of independence and opinion. He's mobile enough to put up a fight during bedtime or run away and demand more TV or computer time. So giving him freedom and ability to influence the routine while establishing limits and boundaries is important. Make sure your child gets lots of opportunity to burn off all that energy during the day. If he's tired, he'll be more ready to gear down for bed. Ask your child to take the lead in his bedtime activity. Let him tell you what step comes next and give him some freedom to make choices within each step, like which pajamas do you want to wear, the airplanes or the stars? Or shall we read the dinosaur book or the caterpillar book? Let your child demonstrate to you his knowledge of the routine and give him some control over choices. Feel a sense of belonging that comes from having a role in this routine and enjoy a degree of independence from his choices. Give your child a chance to ask for a second book and give him the freedom to choose this book. Ask your child what book he would like to read at bedtime. Feel confident that he can make choices and have some independence. Be patient with your energetic preschooler. If he won't settle down, don't engage in a struggle of the wills. Explain why it's important for him to have quiet time and then get a good night's sleep. Calmly explain why it's important to have a good night's sleep. Understand that you know and care about what is right for him. He will trust you and start to self-regulate. If you comfort, play with, and teach your child every day, through the everyday moments you are already sharing, you will open a world of possibilities for you both. For more information about parenting, child development, and comfort play and teach, visit investingkids.ca.